Hey guys, Corey Samples here with an update on Shikari. Today makes seven days we've had her here and she's done absolutely great. Now she still won't really eat off the tongs, but she is going severely after crickets as soon as I drop them in now and she will eat her fuzzies. So it's a good thing that she's at least staying uh, nutrition or, or fed anyway. Uh, she still has a little bit of a time with when you come near the glass. Uh, if she's too close and you make a fast move, she will run off. Uh, but for the most part, she's done really great, and I've not handled her, her any time since day number two, which was my Melanus handling video that I put up uh, this time last week. So for now, uh, let's jump into it. I've got her in the tub already, uh, so she can have her bath going on. And if you can't already See tell that. behind me that I have some netting and binary hung up. Now, I'm going to go ahead and move this because I, nice uh, one, sweet I didn't think about that, the wife. Sorry about that. Uh, <laughs> but the rest of this, I kind of got just cheaply at Hobby Lobby so that she had the ability to climb on something. Now, I do have the plan to string out a giant net across my bathroom and make all kinds of other wall features throughout my bathroom because our master bathroom has vaulted ceilings and it's rather big. Uh, but for the most part right now, we're just dealing with this small area until she learns to trust her environment and start exploring. So let's get into it and see how she's doing. Shikari. Good girl. I'm not very good at this. I hit the wrong button. See, there we are, guys. We got a nice calm relaxed melanus right now now of course if we make any fast movements she is going to run uh she has already jumped up there she goes again all uh, right she's not a big fan of cameras yet uh but with time we'll we'll take that out of her because uh the camera will pretty much always be on her uh, now, I will say this, I will have another uh, unboxing video coming up soon and uh, a new addition as I just got a, well, I'm in the process of purchasing a male melanus uh, around her age and size to cohabitate with her. Uh, now, I know a lot of you guys out there are probably going to leave comments and tell me that's a bad idea. However, I've done a ton of research and I've talked to a ton of people who are, man, specifically in the melanus breed. And I have heard mixed reactions, however, the pros outweigh the cons, and from what I've read, more people say that it's good in a long-term basis so that they build trust and care and socialization skills. Uh, kind of like a dog, if one dog will come to you, the other one will come to you as well. So that's kind of my thought process on this, uh, and I found a really great male that I really want, so we're going to go ahead and get him, uh, and we'll add him to the collection too. He should be here in about a week, so I will have that unboxing video, uh, video for y'all from K&K &K Reptiles in Cape Coral, Florida. Uh, so stay tuned for that. Uh, for now, we're just kind of letting this little one roam around and do her thing. Uh, you know, she's she's been relatively easy. I had her in the shower or in the tub for about five minutes before we started this video, uh, and I played with her a little bit before my wife could come in here and grab the camera for me. Uh, she swam right up under my hand, uh, probably three or four times. She hasn't quite figured out uh, the stuff up top yet. Of course, I don't think I have it down low enough for her to get there. I could probably raise the water level up just a little bit, but I haven't actually finished everything in this cornering the way I want to do. So it's gonna take a little more time, and once that time comes up, then I'll be able to do it. Mommy, what? I want Sorry, that's the my daughter coming in here because she hurt herself. However, she is doing quite well. She's being a nice, beautiful little girl. She's been nice and calm. Okay, slow. Be very slow. Okay. Mm -hmm. Stand back, baby. Don't stand over the don't stand over the tub so we're not scared, okay? Uh, 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 She'll come back around so we can see her. See, we're just gonna They say the best thing to do with these guys is to to do this in the water while you're giving them their bath times. It gets them used to being picked up and loved on. You just pick them up a little bit, love on them, put them back down in the water. Let them see what she's doing. So yeah, I'm gonna actually end this video for a few minutes and uh, we'll pick back up in a couple minutes. All right, see y'all soon, thank you. 